So I have some on bike videos coming soon, I promise. Um, I just don't feel like vlogging and commuting to work. Even though it's cycle year, it's an awesome job. It's just kind of like freeway and boring and noisy, so there's a lot of terminology when it comes to riding motorcycles and this topic is about the girls who ride on back of bikes. A little bit of backstory. I've only I've only ridden on the back of motorcycles like twice as a teenager and the rest was like dirt bikes, jet skis, snowmobiles or whatever, but it was hands on it was literally hands on and that's how I that's how I learned. But there are some girls I guess and guys too that only want to ride on the back of bikes. And there's derogatory terms. They're pretty much either made up, sometimes they're funny, but they're mostly stupid. <laughs> One is B-dubs, which I never even heard of, but let me know if you know why. And then we got bike whores. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know. I guess if you could be a whore no matter what. It doesn't matter if you're on the back of a bike or not. Harley hookers. <laughs> That's kind of like uh, self-explanatory. Scooter skanks. I don't know anybody who desperately wants to ride on the back of a scooter, <laughs> but um, I guess they exist. Um, rocket wrenches. <laughs> Sorry, rocket wenches. Uh, tank skanks kind of makes sense. I don't have a problem with them, unless they smell bad. <laughs> Biker liker. Duh. Oh, a tire biter. That one's silly. It's it's weird. It, it kind of doesn't make sense to me because it never felt right to ride on the back of a bike. I have to be like in control and stuff and it's just too awkward. So curb monkey and apparently they're just the girls who sit around like all the bike gatherings, the groups and sit on the curb and just wait for a ride on a motorcycle. One girl that I knew who rode got really really mad that her boyfriend gave another girl a ride. And later on I talked to that girl and we became friends and she <laughs> she prefers to be called a biker bunny. She doesn't care about having her own motorcycle. She just wants to ride on the back of as many motorcycles as she can. And you know later on the dudes were like yeah she'll pretty much sleep with you if you have a motorcycle. And I'm like okay just whatever. <laughs> Tire biter. That's just silly. Tail snail. That I thought was kind of cute because they look like a little backpack. Oh, they call them backpacks too. That's a, a snail looks more like a turbo. Snail tail is totally different. Don't urban dictionary that. But tail snail's cute. Fine. Whatever. Biker bunnies. Cool. Fine. Tank troll. That one kind of makes sense. A biker slut. Either way, a slut. Slut. They're cute. Whatever. Dudes can come up with anything and turn it derogatory. Girls can come up with anything and turn it derogatory. If you don't like being called a tank skank, <laughs> find out why. I mean, it shouldn't bother you if you're confident at all. But if it does offend you, just look in the mirror. You can find out why. First off, name calling. Come on. Grow up. Biker bunnies, scooter skanks, ratchet wenches. They're doing you a favor by showing us the guy's standards. Don't be mad. And there are actually girls who just want a ride on the back of a motorcycle. They just look cute. Some of them totally love the thrill of it. The name calling is just, either way, a motorcycle or not, it's, it's childish. And you should probably look in the mirror too, <laughs> find out why you're so angry. Thank a tank skank. So regardless, anytime anyone buys a motorcycle, rides on the back of a motorcycle to attract the opposite sex will either weed themselves out of the gene pool or if they're lucky potentially add to it. Either way, I hope everybody uses protection. <laughs> okay, ride safe guys. Talk to you later. Uh -huh. And I have a visitor coming from Australia. Trid in motor vlogs, but we're gonna go down to Vegas and check out the Supercross, the Monster Supercross. Uh, event that they're having down there and I'll just show them around Utah a little bit and maybe I'll let him ride my bike I don't know we'll see <laughs> he can be my biker bunny <laughs>